Thanks. You're at the University of Chicago for, in the wake of the first round win for University of Chicago, here with head coach Maria Williamson. Hi, I'm Mallory. Uh, I'm Ellie. Grace Hines. <laughs> Nice, I was going to pick it up. Nice. I've had trouble with microphones before, guys. <laughs> Maria, go ahead and uh, just uh, some opening thoughts. You know, first round game, you know, it's always, you know, trying to feel things out in the postseason. How do you think this first one went for you? Yeah, I mean, definitely at least happiest with our defensive effort. I mean, holding them to 48 points is a really big deal. We were really focused on defending the three-point line. We did that really well. Um, and we just made it really tough for them from the start. Obviously, our first quarter was awesome, and then we kind of settled in from there. You know, it's not our best shooting night, but that's okay. Like, we we knew we were going to get a lot of open shots, and we'll be ready to knock them down tomorrow. But I think a really good start to the tournament for us um, in terms of confidence. Uh, Grace, um, 1,000 points you got to it. Yeah. So, I mean, it's probably a pretty big... Uh, you know, it's a big milestone, especially in three years worth of playing, but uh, how satisfying was it to know that, hey, you could get this thousandth point, but you get to do it in the postseason, you know, and keep your career going? Yeah, I mean, it was just a pretty cool opportunity. I mean, not a lot of players, um, you know, get, like, get to be able to do this, and so um, I was just grateful that we made the postseason and we got to compete today, and then, you know, big credit to, like, all the teammates I've had over the past couple years, and then especially to this group, and so, um, and all my family's here, so, and my sisters are home from college, so it was nice to see them in the stands and to be able to celebrate with um, all my family, and a couple friends came down, too. Now, for the two seniors, obviously, you've both been to the postseason as, as first years, but now, again, here as seniors, kind of bookending your career, how important was that first year to kind of get that feel, get that experience, so you kind of knew what to expect? I go, you can go, I just don't. <laughs> uh, yeah, I mean, we have a really special team this year, so it's really nice to kind of finish out our careers, like, with a postseason, um, and we're really excited for it. And, I mean, freshman year, we also had a special group that, like, really led Grace and I super well and, like, just set us up, um, gave us a great example to be able to be a part of this team and help lead this team here so far. Yeah, and I'll just add, um, I think that, you know, that first year, it showed us what it takes to get here, and it's not easy, and so being able to build off that and know what it takes to have a championship kind of team, uh, I feel like that really set the foundation for um, the attitude and the mindset that we came in with going into this season, and we've been able to translate that and carry it in through um, throughout our non-conference and now finishing conference and going into the postseason. Ellie, this is your postseason debut. How was it? Were there any nerves or jitters early on? But it looked like, you know, starting the game out 17-0, it didn't seem like much. <laughs> yeah, I mean, we definitely started really well. Um, I think that having these two on the floor, especially with, like, some tournament experience was so huge. They've led us great, like, all year. And then especially in the postseason, just stepped up, had a calming presence. I think me and the rest of the underclass were definitely uh, a little amped up. That showed a little bit in our shooting tonight. Um, but now that we're settled in, I'm really excited for the rest of the tournament. Now, Coach, you had a late night game, probably the latest game you've ever played. Uh, so what's it take to kind of, you know, you know, you're on to the next round. You know, less than 24 hours, you're going to be back at it again. What's it going to take to uh, win uh, a round two game and be ready for it? A lot of rest tonight. I think the alarms will be late tomorrow, which will be great. We'll get them some lunch, and then we'll shoot around and just keep our normal routine. You know, I think that's it's all about confidence. And it was fun to be able to watch the triple overtime game before us and to see kind of what we're in for tomorrow. And I think it's just going to be a really good battle. They're relentless. We're relentless. Um, I think it's going to come down to knocking down big shots. And so we'll we'll focus on that a lot tomorrow and shoot around. But really excited for the opportunity.